Temperatures are warming up across the country, and you know what that means. Bathing suits are coming. I am on the third day of my cleanse diet. All I have to do is drink maple syrup, lemon juice, cayenne pepper, and water for all three meals. Um, I just bought some bikinis online, size two, so I look amazing. Yeah, right. Uh, remember the juice diet and cabbage <laughs> diet and cooking Hard diets and all yes. that? They were popular a few years back. Uh, did not work for us, didn't work for Kelly from the office either. But one thing that does work is good old healthy competition. And one company is helping you take on your co-workers for a chance at not only cash and prizes, but you also get to lose weight in trying to lose that weight. Yeah, when we say cash, we mean a lot of cash. $10,000 for a team winner in some contests. The group is called Healthy Wage. We've got the co-founders, David Roddenberry and Jim Fleming, uh, join us now. Guys, uh, thank you for joining us. We've got Brian Vergalt next to me, a participant in a program. We're going to talk with all three guys. Let's start in New York. Um, uh, tell us how this works. Well, a healthy wage makes weight loss more effective by making it fun. So we give you a chance to win uh, up to $10,000. Uh, by participating in our challenges. And all you have to do is lose weight. Easy enough, right? <laughs> For some to say. Hey, Brian, you are in a, uh, a program, and you said it's it's uh, like a 10% program. Explain what this is. Um, so what I'm doing is uh, up front I paid $150, um, weigh in, and then what I'm going to do is in 10%, if within six months, if I lose 10%, they'll actually double my money and give me $300 for losing that weight. Yeah. Do you really feel that sort of the heat of the competition from your coworkers, is that really a driver for you to lose weight? It is. I mean, the money, too. I mean, just thinking about it. I'd, the last thing I want to do is lose $150, so if that can go into a situation, $300, winning $300 is great, but to not lose $150, that's even better. Hey, Jimmy, tell me, is it the competition you found or the money that really is the prime motivator here for the weight loss? Uh, well, they're two completely separate tools, and they're both super effective. So when you're on a team and you know that other people's prize hangs in what you're doing, that's a powerful motivator because the other people on your team uh, aren't going to be too happy with you if you let them down. So that's that's one tool. And then a completely separate tool is your own desire to, as Brian was saying, uh, avoid losing the money that you've invested. And also you want to try to win money. So you have all sorts of things pushing you along, which is one of the things that makes it so effective. And it's also one of the things that makes it so much fun. David or Jim, you know, obesity is a big issue uh, in this country. What kind of effect does it have, let's say, on the workplace? You know, are we really less productive when, when we're overweight? Absolutely. I, I, you know, I think that um, what we hear is from people who have lost the weight after succeeding and winning money at Healthy Wage, and they just report that, A, they've gone off their medications, B, they're more productive, they're more active, they're more successful, both um, personally and professionally, the, the self-confidence that you get when you make a positive life change. And, you know, at Healthy Wage, we're all about putting a, a little money in your pocket when you, when you make that change. Who's putting that money up? Is it the company or is it uh, your company? Well, we have a mix of revenue sources. So uh, employers um, pay us to help their employees uh, get healthy. Um, participants like Brian put in the $150 because they're more motivated by not losing the 150 that they've invested. And then we're also supported by sponsors, health insurance companies, uh, health systems that are interested in creative solutions to obesity. And, uh, and this seems to be a very promising avenue to, uh, to, to reverse our nation's obesity ep epidemic. It's important to be clear, though, that the, everyone's eligible to participate, not just people who work at companies that are doing Healthy Wage, but anyone watching can go to HealthyWage.com and, and try to win up to $10,000 for losing weight. So we've opened it up to the whole country. Do you have any tips to get everybody started on losing weight? Well, I think it's about figuring out the program that's going to work best for you. So we have a, a BMI challenge, which is one year long for folks who are obese and looking to make that really significant life change, get to a healthy weight. And then we have a six-month challenge, like Brian's doing, which is a lot more manageable. It's 10% uh, of your weight, which is basically a pound a week, and you double your money if you're successful. So that, you know, if you're looking at sort of a temporary change, that might be a fit. And then we also have a team challenge where you compete in teams for a $10,000 grand prize. And if you have a family members or coworkers, um, just a group that you think, um, you know, that accountability of, of losing weight would be a group would be a fit, you know, we'd encourage you to, uh, to sign up for that one. So let's talk about success. Is it working for you? It is. I'm a little over two months in. I've already lost 16 pounds. Okay. And that puts you at what percentage because you've got to get to 10? Um, I need to lose a total of 25, okay. so a little over seven. How much more time do you have? Uh, about four more months. Okay. Think you can do it? I think so. Let me, uh, <laughs> last question coming out to New York because there are studies that have come out in the Journal of American uh, Medicine 
that, yeah, these programs work to get people to lose the weight, but so many, if not the lion's share of the participants, gain the weight back. So what then is the benefit for the individuals who participate and the companies who thought they were going to save money uh, by, you know, reducing the health care costs? Well, the, the problem of uh, weight loss and, and weight maintenance is a, is a different problem, and the type of financial incentive solution that works for weight loss is different for weight maintenance. So in a weight loss paradigm, having a goal, like 10% weight loss over six months, it's very, um, it, it helps you lock in and, and be successful. Whereas um, in a um, maintenance type of phase, you know, you don't have a goal. Your goal is like every day. You just want to eat healthy and, and, and be successful at keeping your weight off. So we've, um, we've piloted maintenance type of uh, schemes that have been very successful, um, you know, uh, with, with different types of financial incentive programs. Instead of like a bet, um, it's, it's a different type of um, program. So we see promise um, with financial incentives both on the weight loss side and um, on, the, on the weight maintenance side. Well, we know that maintenance is the hardest part. It mm -hmm. is. Keeping it up. David Roddenberry, Jim Fleming in New York, uh, thank you so much. Brian Bergolk, good luck with your competition. And congratulations on what you've lost so far. Yeah.